Okay, so another battle, this time against Trombones13. And uh, this was actually a pretty fun battle, and uh, pretty interesting too. So let's get this started. He leads off with Haunch Crow, and I'll lead off with Rapidash. And I avoided a Sucker Punch, which was good, because I used a track. So at least now I know that he has a uh, Sucker Punch. And a switch to Soul Rock, and obviously Return doesn't do much. So expecting a super effective attack of some kind, I switch out Rapidash and I'll send in my Golduck. And they set up Stealth Rock, which could be a pain. So I'll have to figure out how to deal with that. In the meantime, I'm expecting a switch out, so I'll take the opportunity to stat boost with Calm Mind. And they bring out Starmie, and Starmie is obviously faster than Golduck, and Starmie tends to carry in electric attack, always, I've seen it, so I'm going to switch out to Venusaur, and boom, as predicted, electric attack. And, oh crap, I got paralyzed, come on. Anyway, expecting Ice Beam now, but uh, the opponent actually uses Psychic, and Psychic does a lot more damage, but thankfully Venusaur can hang in there, and because of its health being at where it was, I think Overgrow activates, which makes Giga Drain even more powerful. So Starmie's out of the picture, and that was actually really good for me because Starmie could be a threat, and to have it taken out early in the game uh, really put me at ease. But then the opponent switches into uh, Weavile, and Weavile is going to probably use Ice Punch, and so I'm going to switch out to Hitmontop and Intimidate it, because somehow a little spinning thing that looks like some kind of Beyblade thing, it can intimidate something as fierce as Weavile. Go figure. So they used... Oh crap, I missed the attack. Oh, well, anyway, they used something. And that hurt me a little bit. And so I'm just kind of waiting to see what they do. And they... Okay, they retreat. So I went with Mock Punch, because if I used High Jump Kick and they have a Ghost type, uh, and I miss, then Hitmontop is going to be screwed. So I just used Mock Punch to hit whatever was coming my way. But since they sent out Heracross, a fearsome threat, I have to be careful now, but uh, I don't have anything to deal with Heracross on him on top, so I'm just going to stay in. So Rapid Spin, Stealth Rocks away, and I'm just going to leave him on top in there to see what else this Heracross packs. Uh, so far they keep using Stone Edge, which is weird because it's not effective, so maybe they're Scarfed, but then I don't know why he used Stone Edge in the beginning. Anyway, so now I'm going to retreat and send in Golduck. Which is a little risky, but I'm hoping he could take take an attack. Now I think Golduck is faster, so I'm planning to hit hit Heracross with Psychic. And hopefully my opponent doesn't expect that. And good, they didn't. So my plan succeeded, and Psychic takes out Heracross, because Heracross is weak to Psychic. Part being part fighting. The part bug type doesn't protect it, so all you Heracross users, you know, make sure to keep that in mind. So the waiting game and oh yeah, okay, he brings out Hunchgrow! And Hunchcrow is probably going to Sucker Punch, yep. So I'm going to stack boost with Calm Mind. And now they probably think I'm going to attack, so I'll do the exact opposite and use and use uh, Calm Mind once more. But this time they didn't use Sucker Punch, okay. So use Drill Peck, and oh, okay, survive. Citrus Berry to heal me. And now I'm going to wash away Hunchcrow with a Surf Attack. Hunchcrow is gone. Now, the waiting game. Do, 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 Okay, there you go. Out, out comes Tauros. And Tauros is probably gonna ram the shit out of me right now. But I'll stay in anyway. Holy crap, I actually survived that Stone Edge. Unbelievable, considering Tauros' high attack. So anyway, wash away with Surf. Out of sight, out of mind. Now for the next Pokemon. It's back to Weavile! And Weavile is going to use Aerial Ace. And takes out my Golduck. But now that I know he has Aerial Ace, I can be careful uh, when I switch in. Hitmontop! Hitmontop! Hitmontop, again, uses its Intimidate to cut Weavile's attack. Because somehow Weavil, Weavile is intimidated by a spinning thing, a spinning top with legs. So I used Mock Punch, and they stayed in, surprisingly, but they had a Chopple Berry that weakens Mock Punch's power, and they used Ice Punch. And the Intimidate weakened Ice Punch, 
And, oh crap, I was going to use Mock Punch to finish it off, but they had Ice Shard. And because Weavile is faster, his Ice Shard takes priority over my Mock Punch. But now I have my Ninjask, Hayaku. And Hayaku is going to speed all over Weavile. Oh, okay, it retreats. So out comes Soul Rock, but X Scissor still cuts Soul Rock down to size. Which was surprising because I thought being part rock, uh, X Scissor would be neutral damage, but I guess not. So now it's back to Weavile, and no chance for Weavile. X Scissor whoosh, slices him down to size. So good game, Trombones, good game.